to be employed in New York, you needed a police card or cabaret card. If I decided I wanted to be a musician, I'd have to go to the police, put my fingerprints down, and get my card. And that card would be in my possession until such time as I would commit a crime. Then that card would be removed. He had lost his. His friend Bud Powell was leaving town and asked him to drive with him to the airport. They made a stop, and uh, Bud Powell got out, got back in with some drugs, so the cops saw whatever he had in their hands flying out the window. Who threw it out? Thelonious Monk. And so he was arrested and convicted and got, um, I think, 90 days. He said he never used, he was not guilty at that time. The police in those days, and we're talking about the 50s, maybe it started even earlier, their favorite target seemed to be jazz musicians. I mean, there were some cities that were outright unfriendly. And I think that bothered him. So he'd ra rather stay in New York. It was during that period, in the process of getting his car, that I found this little bar on 3rd Avenue called the Five Spot.